All right, Fiona Anderson checking in with us from Business in Vancouver. Good morning, Fiona. And good morning, Steve. Uh, Premier Christy Clark made an announcement yesterday. That's right. So this is the time of year when the Association of Mineral Exploration has its big roundup, and mining companies come from everywhere to talk about mining issues. And so Premier Christy Clark took the opportunity yesterday to announce an extra $6 million for the Ministry of Energy and Mines. Now this money is going to go to increase staff so that there can be more inspections, quicker inspections, and important, more importantly probably, quicker turnaround for permits. This has been a big complaint of the mining industry. You know, they find some property they like, it takes so long to get permitted, by the time they actually get the permits, it's probably too late, the price of the commodity has gone down. Um, so hopefully this will speed things up. Now the $6 million is not actually new, but the money has been coming. That money for increased staff has been coming from a contingency fund. So this makes it more solid, more available. You know, it's a confirmation that it will be around. Um, the Premier also said they plan to get another $3 million in permit fees. So that actually ups the budget, almost doubles the budget for the ministry from about $11 million to $20 million. And now why are they doing this? Well, because exploration actually has fallen in the uh, province. If we look at the numbers, last year in 2014, there was um, $338 million was spent on exploration. That's a 34% a dis a a decrease from the $476 million that was spent in 2013. And uh, now our, we peaked at $680 million in 2012, and then we're at $463 million again in 2011. So she's hoping that this money and this permitting and inspection might actually spur the exploration industry again. But those numbers are partly because of commodity prices. You know, the price of gold peaked in 2012. Price of copper was pretty high in 2011, leading to exploration in 2012. So as long as commodity prices are, are weak, I'm not sure how much this was stimulated, but it can't hurt. All right, Fiona, thank you very much. If you want thank some you. more details, go to BIV.com. And uh, Fiona will be back in an hour with more business news about a new uh, store that's going to be opening up here in the city. So stay with that's us right. for that. Okay, let's get to traffic.